Alright, verse 2. So, I'm tearing up, trying to get my mind cleared up. Nothing you ever gave me would I ever tear up. I sometimes look at it to cheer me up. The last balloon that you found in my room, you made a bloom with a million different hearts on it. Every time I pick up my sweatpants and shirt that you gave back to me, finally, when everything wasn't working, that was the birthing of a sad kind of guy. I gave it one last chance, and I ain't talking about trying to get into your pants. I wanted to get into your heart, you know. Hit the spot, show you what I got to offer. That's what I did when I signed the lot to I love you, boo, at the bottom, MCC, as its author. And it hurts, cause I know in the past, while we weren't able to make it work, you were a jerk. I acted worse, but no. That's it. Ain't no more birds chirp will I ever hear. Roll over and see my dear, whisper in her ear, kissing for each of our cheers. We were so near, why the fuck weren't we able to make it? Both of us were fucking traitors. I misbehaving. You went away, not physically. Well, that too. But mentally, I felt like a bully. Cause whenever I brought it up, you would just push and pull me. But you see, all I ever wanted to be was your best friend, but you already had a load of those. From the beginning, it was clear that you had chose those mofos as the ones you wanted to be with. I would feel sick. Back in the dormitories, when you tormented me. Feels like a part of a sad romantic comedy. But you took me around to your friends, and I was cool with that. I was down with it. But as soon as you left the presence, you made it up that you were tempted to pivot your emotions. Acted so cold to me, I felt like I was shivering in the Atlantic Ocean. Your heart wasn't always open, and this is unfair. So just let this be known then, that this is just one side of the story. I'm not trying to make myself out like I'm all rich and gloried. This is just some of my thoughts coming from my cot as I rot all sad and depressed. This is where I always get right before I go to bed. Shit, the love letters you have sent. They are so beautiful. Makes me want to be glued to you, but we both got our evil sides. You make me cry, I make you cry. I could go on all night. But at this moment, this is a bigger bite than I ever wanted to handle. Please, to your friends and family, and to you especially, don't look at me as a vandal. If anything, look at me as if I were handled. <laughs> See? I know some musicians. Shit, the clues glistened. Am I pretending to you, or me, or anybody to who with this will see? I don't know. I gotta go.